Hey guys, so here I am today. I'm going to show you how you go into a conference if a teacher through Canvas has asked you to do so. So as you can see here, I'm logged into the practice course. Okay, and over here on the side, I should see conferences. If I see conferences, that means the teacher has opened that option up for our class. If I don't see it and they've mentioned that I need to be in a conference, remind your teacher to move the navigation, okay? So all you have to do is click conferences and you'll see that there is a practice conference waiting. I can't do anything at this point because the teacher hasn't automatically opened that up for me yet. So I'm waiting for that to happen. Now you can see that the teacher has made this prop, she is in or he is in the conference. It is now live and you can click join. So when you join this conference, it's going to ask you how you want to listen. Okay, if you want to be able to talk to your teacher, you're going to need to click microphone. If you just want to listen and type, just click listen only. We're going to click microphone for this moment and I'm going to show you some things there that need to be done with that. So when that happens you're going to get do you want to allow this site access to your microphone? You're going to click allow. Now I went ahead and muted because of the fact that this is I'm recording so I'm getting a lot of echo and feedback. But you'll notice that over here on the side, the student and the teacher are both in the session. Teacher can, can chat and the student can chat back. Very simple. There are some options here that the teacher can give. So this is the teacher moving around on the key on the screen and the teacher can set this to be even set this to be a multi-user whiteboard so you as the student would come in and choose your tools are you going to write you're going to draw a rectangle triangle circle line or are you going to do text if you do text you're going to draw a text box you'll notice that you now have a cursor in there so you can type on the screen where your teacher needs you to do so. So the teachers have been known that they can upload a PDF here and you can write on it so that they can interact with you and see how your learning is. So there's lots of things if you want to redo, undo something, if you want to clear everything you've done, you can do all of those things. When you are all done and it's time for you to leave, you simply come to the three dots and you log out of this session. You are currently the only person in this conference. So that logs you out of the conference. As long as it's in progress, you can go back in and join. And you can choose, and this time I'm going to choose to listen only. Because if I have headsets that don't have the microphone, this is all I can do unless I unplug my headset from my Chromebook. The teacher is going to come in and end the meeting, and everybody's gone. So I hope that's helped you figure out how to do conferences.